Let's go. Let's get it. Dope girls, yeah, it's a podcast. Two dope girls, yeah, we speaking all facts. Two dope girls, yeah, we got it, just relax. Two dope girls, hit like, subscribe back. Two dope girls, and we only never slack. Two dope girls, and we got each other back. Two dope girls, and we coming for the cash. Two, two dope girls, and we all about a bag. Dope, dope girls, alright. Hey, what was so broke? Off of our own song. As we should. I'm an artist and I'm sensitive about my, <laughs> my shit. shit. <laughs> What's up, you guys? Welcome back yes. to Two Dope Girls Podcast. Yes. I am yes. Grace. What's I going on? I am LaDonna. On? What What's is up, LaDonna? How you girl, been, girl? Not much. Not much. I've just been chilling out, waiting for podcast day. I, I told know. you it'd be the highlight. It'd be the highlight. I'd be Look, ready. When, um, I used to hear like Mustak and them say um, how that's like their therapy. This really mm. is like a little, yes. a little woo moment, moment for the girl. It really is. I'm stuck in the I house really every week. Myself. I'm I stuck mean, in the house day in and day out yes. with men. Yes. I'm actually have, ready to start podcasting together again. Yes. We're going to next week. We're yes. being person. Absolutely. Before Baby, I go. How was your week, girl? <laughs> Y'all didn't see her face. Y'all will see it later. But y'all didn't see her it face just now. Good. I know it was good. It was good. Um, I didn't do much of anything. Mm-hmm. Worked, was in the house. Mom, but I'm here, you know. Barely. Barely, but I'm I'm speaking I'm for here. myself. <laughs> Look, I'm with you. I'm I'm barely kicking, but I'm here. How about you? Um Another week, same thing. You know, I only worked out one time this week and Me I didn't feel bad right? about it. I didn't I feel bad don't. about it. I, I, well, I really don't. I, I did because I could have gotten up this morning, mm-hmm. but I've just kind of been, you know, blah, feeling blah, whatever. But um, one time I haven't, I haven't worked out one time a week in a very long time. So that sucks, but it is. I what did it in is. December. I think it's like once a month. I just, I'm just like, I, I can't do it. Girl. I need to I'm take good. a mental and physical break from it, yep. from everything. Yep. Yeah. Like, seriously. Um, when it was, when was it? Yesterday, yesterday was Thursday. Okay. So yesterday, um, my husband went to the gym and we normally go to the gym Thursdays together. I mean, we normally go, we go to the gym all the time together, but. Right. He, um, he, he pulled the covers over my head and he was like, are you coming? I said, no, I'm not coming. But when he left, I couldn't go back to sleep. And what I did, I went in the middle of the bed, pulled the covers all the way up to my chin. I turned on the TV until it was time for me to log into work. And I felt good about it. And I was just like, fuck that gym. I know that's right. Sometimes you have to say it. (laughs) Sometimes you have to say it. I did. My sister's um, birthday was Thursday. Happy birthday, Shonda. I know. Happy birthday, Sissy. Um, she, we went to brunch mm-hmm. for her, for her birthday, me, my mom, my aunt and my niece. And, um, and yeah, I'm just so proud of her just to shout her out. Yes. She is now a real estate agent. So, Come you on, know, girl. you guys that are looking for an, a home to sell or to buy, make sure you hit up homes for Hardy with Chandra Hardy Yeah, on Facebook, hit her up, DM her. Check out her information. Get in touch with her. She is a dope girl, just like her sister. For sure. And look, it, it, look when we talk about the week, you're like, oh, I didn't do nothing. And then you start talking. And then and I'll be remembering. You remember. You know, I have to remember. <laughs> but I actually FaceTime LaDonna. I mean, LaDonna. Y'all the same person anyway. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I actually FaceTime Shanja today because I went to go see my mom. I did a quick turnaround trip to New Orleans. And I just went to go, you know, see her, look at her face, make sure she's okay. Right. And I had FaceTime Chandra. I FaceTime her. She had on like a um a, a satin cap on her head. And then I was like, look, Chandra, because she told me to FaceTime her when I see my mom again. Mm-hmm. So I was like, look, it's my mom. And she, 
Girl, she ripped that thing off so ripped fast. Ripped that thing and right on off and popped that, them up there. <laughs> I was Girl. like, Chandra, you did not have to do that. It is okay. But yeah, I, I saw my mom today. I was so happy to lay my eyes on her. Oh, no. She's looking good. She's good. feeling well. I'm just, I'm happy. I'm blessed. Yes. We are continuing to pray for yeah. her. Yeah. Yes. But I mean, yeah, you, for those of you, of you who don't know, my mom has dealt with, um, last year, right at the beginning of the pandemic, she was diagnosed with multiple myeloma, which is um, a cancer of the bone. Yeah. yeah. And it was looking not good for her. But you yeah. know, power of prayer. We were there for her. We you. always praying for her, and she is in remission. She's had her stem mm-hmm. cell treatment. She's going through yeah. that, but she looks good. Her hair yes, is coming in, Mama. Good. Yeah. So, and look, you know, mom has always got it. <laughs> thank you. Moms always have to say some slick to you. Everything. First of all, Warren walked up. She was like, "Is your is your mom feeding you?" Does he yes. look skinny? Warren is skinny. <laughs> Warren is skinny. Warren is skinny. So I just mm. I know he has big old cheeks. My my that. cousin calls calls him Mr. Cheeks. <laughs> so um because he's always had those cheeks since he was little. But I was walking away when I, you know, we were saying our um farewells. Mm-hmm. And um she was like, Crazy, you're getting skinny too. And Warren is all she eat is giraffe foods, all she eat is plants. And I'm like, I'm so weak. I'm like, I, I don't feel like I'm getting skinny. I've heard that from people, but I think it's because of the, the chest. We had talked about that earlier because I just you feel like so? I'm heavy chested. I mean, I but feel. you're you're itty bitty to me anyway. I'm five two. Like, yeah, you I mean, I can't I, I'm I tiny. Yeah. But whatever. It, hey, you're 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 fun sized. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. You know who calls me that? Lacey really she well does. coming from the two giants right i know <laughs> yeah, that, was, <laughs> <laughs> that was my week and i had a good okay. week though i mean it, it's same day in day out whatever. but you know who, who's been kind of motivating me like okay look on you need to get on your crap who? girl you know my fave uh, meg the stallion you know she got heidi boot camp <laughs> hello heidi boot camp well hello First- fine ass <laughs> Girl, every time I see her run across my deck on time, I'll be like, dang, I should have went out and worked out today. I know. She look good. She does. I mean, she's young. She's she look good before. She is, anyway. And she has a she has a chef cooking for her. Like we we definitely we cannot all, be mm-mm. hard on ourselves because we don't have the same amenities these people have. Like, of course they're supposed to be in shape. They have and lights, camera, good. action. They have everything that they need at their disposal. We got to run to Publix real quick. Right. We can't send our personal trainer to Publix and clean out our refrigerator. I'm personal trainer. She is me. Right. He's the personal oh. nutritionist, right? <laughs> I still got a nine to five people getting on my nerves. I got to answer this to this person, answer to that person. I don't right. feel like working out. Leave me alone. I don't feel like it. Stupid. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> let, me, let me have my gut today. How about that? Oh, let Let's me say eat, nothing about let, it. Let me eat my fries. That's what I want. That's it. Because I Period. love me some pasta. I can't. Ugh. That's one thing I did give up or not kind of give up, but like taper away from mm-hmm. um, the new year was pasta. And I, I definitely noticed, noticed a difference because I'm not as bloated. Yeah. But I love pasta. Oh my gosh. I, I do. I pasta. keep saying, um, I'm going to give up meat and this it's just a lie right now. Right now I'm not even in a space where I can really give up and be disciplined, mm-hmm. truly disciplined with food. You know, it's when you you know how when you're in an emotional space like sometimes some things comfort you and when and I'm at that point right now like any type Baby. of comfort I'll take it. Ice cream, thank you. Right. Fuck them diets. Fuck that diet. I'll be fat. Today. That's okay. A little tub tub. I ain't never heard nobody. Let me tell you something. I gained a little pushing. weight. Sis be looking a little thick in the booty. You know what I'm saying? So I'll take it. <laughs> oh, you know what else we did? I forgot to what? tell you. <clears throat> Excuse me. We, um, Justin came over. Who? How does your family? And you talk about who? Justin, yeah, who we hosted the, um, the fashion show with. Yeah. <laughs> 
So he Where y'all taking pictures of him? Yeah, we did a photo shoot for his line and he came by with um the cutest, the cutest model. She's so cute. Chocolate little skin. Oh, her skin was like so flawless. Loved her. But um they came I need over. to get on my cousin and figure out why he ain't get his cousin to model his stuff. But we'll <laughs> make that a whole nother situation. Yeah, I'm gonna let y'all handle that. I don't got nothing to do with that. Like Tabitha well, Brown said, that's your business. Tabitha Brown said, that's your business. She was like, <laughs> she was in her twenties. She was, in, uh, she was in her twenties. I asked her yeah, how old she was. I think she was like 22, 23. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful girl. So we um, took pictures for them, but he also said, and I'm saying it on this platform and I'm gonna hold him to it. Okay. But he said that he wanted to get us to like host more stuff. Cause he said, y'all were so good. And I was like, Y'all just gave us the mic and expected us to just go ahead and go let's with go. it. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm ready. Like, let's go. Give me the mic. I'm I'm talking. Yes. I'm on it. Yeah. So we're gonna we are um, on it. We're gonna connect with him later. But yeah, I I'm, wanted to tell you that. I wanted to text you, but it was late. I was tired and I was like, I'll just tell Adonna when I see her later that we had talked to um we met with Justin. He is just the sweetest. I love him. He I love his mama. The okay, funny story about Justin, right? Okay. We did not connect as family until very recent. Like we did not know we were family. We started working together. Let me tell you how smooth my cousin is. <laughs> so we're in the cafeteria. I'm about to pay for my, my food. He's in front of me. He's paid for his food. I'm about to pay for my food. And I pull out my money or my card. I can't remember. And all of a sudden I see, you're good. I'm going to get hers. I said, oh. I clutch my pearls because I know he young. I said, hey, that's a little young tender thing. Little tender. Said, no, you're good. You're fine. He was like, no, I got it. So shots all right. I'm not going to continue to fight you on. I'm about to fight you. Thank you. Right. So he paid for it and just left, girl. That's how, that's how a and nice gentleman is supposed to do. Oh, and he a camper. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he wanted to <laughs> watch out for them. You gotta watch out. Watch out for you, them. They make you feel omegas. like you, they make you feel real special. And how you like? <laughs> did he just pay for my food and leave? The audacity! He didn't even the ask me what my name was. <laughs> That's what they want you to be like. Where he at? <laughs> leave that air of mystery. Mm-hmm. But yeah, he was so sweet. Like he never came at me like that. But I thought that was the sweetest thing. Yeah. And later on, we found out that we were cousins, and we've been like this ever since. He's he's super sweet. He's super yeah. generous. He's super just. If he's doing something, he's always gonna let us know and say, "Hey, do you guys want to take pictures?" Mm-hmm. And we've done that for like years. We've been wow. with him like taking pictures for a long time, and like he would invite us places. But I never really, real, and even when I used to see him at work, I would be like, hey, just, just a little, little head nod because mm-hmm. I really didn't know him like that. But getting yeah. to know him, he's such a, a genuine person. So sweet! Oh my so goodness, sweet. his mom Shan did an amazing job. I love yeah. Shan. She's everything. Yes. She's yeah. beautiful. Yes, she used to always call me her twin. Like ladies call you her twin. She used to always call me her twin. Yeah, she like, hey, is twin. Beautiful. Y'all got that that hair, girl. I passed by a picture the other day came up on my news feed like I guess most I guess it was last year this time mm-hmm. my curls my hair was so oh, <laughs> pop in. I had a moment of silence <laughs> for my hair oh. those of you don't know I, I have I have not always been bald-headed you did have a lot of hair on your head I did but not- it's gone it is what it is Look, I started singing that Three Six Mafia to my um song to my mama t- today, and she was like, "What is that? What what song? All oh, hey, scaly wet. Hey, ain't no got no bed. Chilled up, chilled <laughs> up. We <laughs> and she was like, oh, "What are you trying to say?" I was like, I'm sorry. I was like, "Don't worry about it, mom. Don't worry about it. It, it was lost on you. It. You'll get I it later, it maybe." <laughs> Do we have a game, girl? I know we got a fire-ass show coming up, but do we have a game? Yes. Okay, so let's do a game. And we're going to do a game called um, Name Those Celebrity Kids. Okay. I'm going to suck at this, but I have my drink, (laughs) so I'll be taking my sips. Okay, so do you want to go first or do you want me to go first? 
go for, okay no i want you to go first because i'm not really sure on how you want this game to be okay so, so i'm like, gonna name the celebrities and you tell me their kids that's oh, just that's i'm still it. not going to get it but okay <laughs> <laughs> okay so you have 10 seconds to tell mm-hmm. me the name of ti and tiny's kids all of them that's a lot of kids grace well paris um let me go and take my drinks i can see all <laughs> them little blonde hair kids um king okay um uh what's the little cute one that just had the baby i don't know you tell me i don't know i can't think of these kids names look i'm over here it's not ten seconds over. Ten seconds over. Ten seconds over. Ten seconds over. Go ahead. There we go. <laughs> so it's Aries. Messiah. One of those cute little so. Oh my cool. god. Harris is cute, yo. She that is that little baby. I, but I don't know who who take the cake. I don't know if it's Harris or I don't know if it's Rain. Toya, baby. Mm. I, that dog on Rain mm. is like so smart. They're raising some this kind of children over there. Yeah, they I are. Know. They are, but I think because they are around like adults and mm-hmm. young adults that they don't do like the little baby stuff, the Google Gaga, all that stuff. Like. No, they are like some they old souls. They little grown, before. little grown women. That's I what they love are. Love me that heiress. She is yes. so adorable. So, so Gary adorable. King, yeah. Damani, Deja with her beautiful self. Messiah, Messiah yes. Mystique with her beautiful, gorgeous self, and then Major. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes. So I took a sip because I, I did. <laughs> but I knew him. I just can't think of that. Was a lot of kids. That's a lot of kids. They got seven kids. Yeah. Yeah, that's a lot. But hey, they doing it. They be they doing it big. They uh, um, they could afford rich. Them, so hey, <laughs> right? right. They're, they're rich. I would they're have seven wealthy. kids if I was rich as well. I wouldn't, but I would. I would probably I got, have about. I got the nanny to watch them. I mean, I don't want I the nanny to watch my babies. I mean, if I want, if I need to go work, if I need to be great at any point, I can take I my get kids that. on vacation. I do get that because my brother and his wife they do have a nanny. Or they did mm-hmm. have a nanny, or they had nannies, but I uh-huh. think because of COVID, they kind of like tapered away from right. that because they're working from home. Mm-hmm. But they have three young ones, right? And I get it. And both of their lives are like hectic. She right. is, she works in a hospital. I think she's an an, an administrator or something. Or mm-hmm. and he's an engineer. So. Yeah. They're, they're like I know uh, my best friend is an administrator and she is ridiculously busy from the time she wake up to the time she goes to sleep and sometimes yes. wakes her up out her sleep so and my niece and nephews are they are busy when yeah. I say busy busy I so what's, they how, what's their ages okay so Dane is I think Dane is Wait, five his name is Dane mm-hmm that is the cutest. I yeah. love that. He's actually, his, he's named after my uncle who passed. His middle name was Dane. His name was Gregory Dane. So my brother named him Dane. So I think mm-hmm. Dane is like five or six. Asher mm-hmm. is three, maybe four. Okay. And then Joey, she's the baby girl. She's two or three. One or the other. Ooh. Yeah, and I'm going to watch them in April while they go on vacation, and y'all pray for me. Bless your heart, girl. Little baby is so long, like little kids are so long. They might not even need you. Like they might not even, you know. They oh, they of- probably will be taking care of me. I'm sure. Right. I was. I was just about to like them. I'm sure they're used to playing with each other they and are. entertaining each each other. That it's probably not even going to be a difficult job. You probably gonna have you. to feed them. Make sure they, they take are, care. They probably could feed themselves. They probably could. I mean, they you'll have to cook for them, which well, is see, for you. Well, normally it's my mom's job, quote unquote job, to watch them while my um my brother is away with his his other family, his in-laws. And mm-hmm. um, all of them are going on vacation for um my sister-in-law's her sister's 40th birthday. All of oh. her family is going to Mexico. So since my oh, mom wow. is sick. Or she, you know, she's at risk, so she can't travel. She can't be the one to watch them now. So yeah. it's TT's job. I'm the one. I'm really the only one that doesn't have small kids anymore. So 
I was oh, like, yeah. okay, I'm gonna step up to the plate. Oh, so pray for me, y'all. I will. I'll pray be for praying them. for you. <laughs> I know. Ooh. I'm gonna be tired. I'm gonna be tired, but that's okay. I look forward. I'm looking forward to it because I I don't get to spend as much time with them. Right. Because they're, um, you know, they live in another state, but I'm, I'm excited, actually. I got um, games and everything. I got a whole list Aww. of things. We're going to do every day. They're probably going to get tired of me. Yeah, I'm sure. They're going to be like, look, I just wanted to get on my tablet. I just wanted to go ride my bike. And but they don't do that. They don't do like the electronics. They have like... They got real instruments in the house. They got bikes that they do. They have they have a dog. So they always go on the bike trail with their mom and dad. They are active kids. My my nephew Dane, he skates skateboards and he is like, he real deal skateboards. Yes. That's cute. But I'm looking forward to it. He can teach me a, a thing or two. Cute. 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 I love so what it. you got? Who you got? Okay, let's see. Let's see. Um Name Michael Jackson children. Oh gosh. Okay, Prince. Is it Paris? Prince and Paris, right? Yeah, Prince and Paris. You're looking at me like I'm not gonna tell you, but Prince and Paris. He only has the last one. There's he three. Uh, I don't know. The the monkey was. Is that we count that one? I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> Lord have mercy. What was the monkey name? I don't know, but blanket. Oh, Michael. Michael Jones. How can I forget blanket? Okay, I'm gonna take a little sip, sip to blanket. <laughs> Here's to you, blanket. Cheers. R.I.P. Michael Jackson, because I love me some Michael Jackson. I, girl, you hear me? I love me some Janet Jackson, like Michael Jackson and Janet Jackson. I grew up off of them. I danced and on team. So I'm a Michael, I'm a Jackson fan. I used to always feel guilty, not guilty, but like a little bashful watching Janet because she's just so sexy. And I'm just like, yeah. like she's I- just the first sexy part. Like, you know, y'all looking at the city girls and Cardi B, but like she was classic. Janet used to be on her physical fitness. Yes. Snatched. I mean, fine. Fine, fine. Had a shape, had a body. Abs. Body, yaddy, 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 yaddy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love Miss Janet. I love her too. Okay, so name Beyonce and Jay Z's children. All them children. <laughs> Blue, Sir. sir. Oh, what's the little girl name? Blue, Sir. <laughs> Do you not know? Give me the first letter. Nope. Ooh. <laughs> well, I don't know. Let me stop trying to think so hard. Rumi. Rumi, that's it. Yeah. Blue, sir, and Rumi. And Rumi. You gonna take a little sip? Oh, yeah. You, know, you ain't, get the, you ain't get the first one. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yes, I'll take my sips. <laughs> okay who you got you got one more or you have two more i got two more okay, okay go ahead so tom cruise and katie holmes daughter apple no that's um who baby name that is other, that's the other um white lady what's her name Shoot. no the baby name is apple her name is apple what's her name uh Chris Gwyneth Paltrow. Gwyneth, Gwyneth Paltrow. Okay, so Tom Cruise and do, do, do. I don't know. I don't know her. That's a good one. Suri. Suri Cruise. Is it Siri? Suri. Suri. Mm-hmm. Okay. Hmm. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> What's your last one? Oh, excuse me. I have two more actually. Oh, okay. Um, Drake. What is his son name? Oh hell, I don't know. You don't know Drake's son name? The um cutie. That's yeah. his name. <laughs> Red hair. Little blonde, little blonde strawberry. cutie. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Strawberry blonde. His name is Adonis. Adonis, that's right. Adonis, that's right. yeah. Oh, let me take my sip. Yeah, take your sip, girl. Name. He is. I just want to hear him speak um French. I do too. 
I just want to hear him I do say too. something like, Bonjour, mon ami. Oh my dear. <laughs> like, just the key, like, just to, just to imagine a baby. Uh-huh. Oh, he's wow. like, what, two? One or two? No. He's still a baby. He might be a toddler. Yeah, but if his mom is French, I'm sure that's all he heard growing up. Well, French and English. And when right. you when you're young like that, they can adapt to both languages or any language. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. I wish I would have done that's that with my baby. I do too. I think I'm gonna try as I was telling you, um, I need to get in touch with Cole and see if I can get Paisley. But I noticed well, that she, she don't do she young starts. babies like that. I know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I noticed that she said she didn't, or she, on her information, she didn't yeah. start that early. It would be nice, talking. though. It would be nice. Yeah. I, I Girl, would. just start speaking Spanish in the house. She may not even know. It just be like... No, listen, <laughs> we're talking about the kid that actually listens to the Spanish version of... Oh, you did say that. Yeah, of, of different little... Anything. Yeah, anything. On, on YouTube, kids, everything is in Spanish version. I used to watch Telemundo just because That's thinking right. I was going to catch on, but I didn't catch on. You didn't catch on. It's I okay. didn't stick with it. <laughs> okay. Is it my turn or you, it's your turn? It's my turn. Okay. It's your last one? Yes. Gabby okay. and Dwayne Wade's daughter. Mm. A little shady baby. Shady. Shady boots. Um, is it Kavia? Kavia. Okay. I wonder where they got that name from. I don't know. That's a lot of A's. Wait, it's a lot of A's. That's a lot of A's. <laughs> a A A V I A. That's like Mississippi. Do you really no. need all them S's and I's? Right. <laughs> Do you if if somebody asks you to spell Mississippi, are you like M I? Cricket letter, cricket letter I. Cricket letter, cricket letter I. Oh wait, was it humping? Oh shit, I don't even know how to spell. You did it. You did. Look, especially after um, uh, what's our show? P Valley. P Valley. Yes. We like M I cricket letter cricket letter I cricket letter cricket letter I hump back hump back. I, I love me. I love them great. girls. They so, so fine. Oh my gosh! When yes. I see that, I don't want. I don't even want to eat. We need to do a pole dancing class. Like I hadn't yes. pole danced ever. Like let's look into that. Yes. I've not done one at all, but I always, this one girl that I always follow on IG, I can't remember her name, but she always pops up on my feed and I'm just like, this is what I want. I want to do that. Right. I want to do it. I want to try it. Let's try it. Okay. So, um, last one for me. Okay. What are, um, Russell Wilson's and Sierra's children's name? I don't know. Sienna. Future. Okay. But I don't know the baby name. All we do is no matter Win. what. Yes. Win. <laughs> baby Win. Yay. They are the that cutest family. That was a good one. I love me some Sierra. I love her too. I'm so happy she has a Automatic. Russell. Naughty, funky, fresh. Work my body so him naughty. This went right through my chest. Uh. Uh, God, I used to love me some Sierra. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I thought I was Sierra when I was back in high school. Okay, so I'm not going to tell you, but I'm gonna tell you anyway. Okay. I know the whole choreography to um ride because I was just like, I have got to learn that. You talking about the one she went on the way you ride Okay, I have to see this. Yeah, girl, I have to see, see it. this. It's the one with Ludacris. I got to see it. Okay. Have, I'm going to have it on repeat. I I been, <laughs> I've just and been I just waiting for the moment to break out those moves. Right. I just <laughs> want you to bust out in your ride moves. Please. One day. <laughs> One day. I can't wait. <laughs> <laughs> Look, so that was a good game. It was a good game. I liked it. I liked it too. And I don't want no more kids, so. That's funny. I do. That was just random, but. Give me a whole <laughs> heap of the mugs. You really want a lot? Honestly, when yeah. I was young, I I used to always tell myself that I didn't want kids. Mm-hmm. And then I just so happened to get pregnant. 
Yeah. And shit happens. Was, shit happens. And I, when I had him, I was like, it would be nice to have another kid. But I had him so young that I just felt like I wasn't ready to have more kids mm-hmm. at such a young age. And that's understandable. So by the time I was just like, you know, I'm not about to do this no more. I don't bl- just let be solo if dolo, it baby. Didn't happen within the next two years. And I don't want it to happen when the, within this next year because I'm um, got a lot like, going on. Yeah, I got a lot going on. Um, but by the, by the time I'm 20, 35, I think um, I'll be ready. Really? Yeah, 35. Can we have a little boy? I hope it would be a little boy. I well, want it to be a little boy. I'm asking God for a little boy. So that's the name. I just remember something, but you know what? Yes. Yes. I love me some Jasmine. I do. Like, she is the most underrated R&B singer of all time. I don't think she gets the accolades that she is supposed to get. She is, man, she's a bet. She's better, way better than a lot of these other artists. Way better. And that's not to, like, shit on them, but... Come on now, Jasmine. That's the rain on her. It's the rain. It's the rain on her. Yeah. So, to water her flowers. Yes. Yes. I love me some Jasmine. Everything. She just likes to. She likes to take my edges. She likes to snatch them. <laughs> she likes to have me with one finger in the air, like yes, like <laughs> with my drink. I don't know whether to have my drink. I don't. I don't know whether to cry and remember when I did this she, because I can relate. She definitely, definitely has me reminiscent on what? every single album that she's ever put out. I can reminisce about a time that. What else she talking about? I can I can reminisce about the time I said, "Bitch, get it together, get it together." Got to stop getting fucked up. Yeah, <laughs> got to stop getting fucked up. And look, it's not even about like drinking fucked up. It could just be like stop. just allowing things to, you know, what I'm saying, get you to a place where you feel like. You, can, you don't have control anymore. Exactly. Like, I feel like that's what she was talking about with bodies. Like, something got her to a place where she didn't feel like she had control anymore. And right. she allowed to her body count to go up. And it's like, bitch, get yourself together. Like, Because, I um, mean, you don't know who you're going home with. You don't. And that's not good, see? Was he a friend? Or a friend of a friend? Was, was he? Who was he? Was he a four? Or was he a ten? Him. Was he a ten? Hopefully, sis. You better hope he. I was about to say, you better hope he was a goddamn ten. You, if you want to add some bodies, she was messed up. She was messed up. So we're gonna say he was a six. Okay, I'll give him a six. If he was a six, that's fine. I mean, if if the if the dig game because it was something. It was something that allowed her to start talking to him. I don't care. Well, how wait a I second. Talking. Does the number represent? Like the total guy, meaning like the <laughs> face, the body, the dick, or does it just like physical impressions? At, at I'm first? sure it's just physical impressions because okay. at the point she don't really know if they are. A she four look. Or she don't even remember what happened, so she don't even no. know what the dick like. She don't even know who they is. Dang. She can't. She can't even recall his first name. Not to say he's even his last name. She can't even recall his first name. You gotta stop getting fucked up. Got to stop getting fucked up, Jasmine. Like, know your she, limits. She, know let me tell you something. Limits. This girl, she had to have like a focus group. That's what I'm gonna say. <laughs> she had, she had a focus she group did. because she did. there's no way that she can have every situation. I feel like every woman in America can be like, damn, that was me. Damn, every woman that was in me. America, even if you don't call yourself a bitch, it's like, bitch, right. get it you together. Bitch ass moments. <laughs> you gotta get your shit together, <laughs> stupid ass. Be looking in the mirror, talking about your stupid ass. What you did that stupid. for? What you do that? Dang. Oh. Or or I didn't hear I didn't hear this like shit. I ain't do it with him. <laughs> <laughs> I know you was there. <laughs> you know you was there. 
Yeah. But he, he don't count. He Come don't on count. Now. Come on. <laughs> so what makes him not count? Like, was the dick bad? Was it like... You got to count that. Even if it's bad, you still got to count it. That's your bad. You can't, you can't all, you can't always have the good ones now. You can take an L without. You got to take your L because you have to learn your lesson. How you going to learn your lesson if you don't take that L? Because if you forget about that, that whack shit, then you're going to be like, oh, okay, it never happened now. And then you might go back. Stupid. Don't Stupid. do that you shit. Got, you got to watch. You got to have some good friends around you. Should nobody be letting you go uh, with no strangers? Why, no watch stranger. your friend that's drinking yeah <laughs> watch your friends that's yes. drinking you know what I'm saying like yes. yeah bodies on bodies on bodies bitch did it together okay get it together I, I, I really like that song I mean I love the whole album but she exactly. said I keep on counting on bodies on bodies I'm like oh my gosh how many how many right I'm sorry but I can only imagine, you know, some women get into that that stage, like they have that whole stage or that phase that's just like, I'm just doing me. You know what I'm saying? People call it whole phase, but shit, why is it a whole for us when it's yes. not a whole for him? And see, I always, I'm not going to say I always thought about that. I've thought about that before and people have asked me and I've asked other people because I mean, mm-hmm. I've been with my husband for so long. Right. Even We've before I game. met him, I, I was not in a lot of relationships. So it's, mm-hmm. You know, I didn't have that like exploratory fun that a lot of people have. And I was like, dang, should I really have a whole phase? Or that's the exploratory fun. It's a whole phase. I'm just, that's the cute way of saying it. It's but- a, yeah, it's exploratory <laughs> fun. Yeah, but- I like that. Exploratory, exploratory fun. fun. Yes. There you go. I like that. Make it, make let's, it cute let's and classy. It. But I didn't have that. So it was just like, yeah. dang. Like, Me neither. I, but honestly, I don't want to wake up and not know who. I don't just slept with right. Like did we use a condom? Like I don't want that fun. Right, you could keep that. Yeah, that ain't my type <laughs> of fun. But I do <laughs> like bodies. Bodies, was, I love bodies. I love yeah, the whole thing. But yeah, I, bodies I haven't heard good. anything like it. Um, put together like it lyrically or musically. So it's um, raw. It's like it's real. Yeah. It's like damn. Yeah, get your shit together. Like, what are you doing? In a, in a classy way. In a classy way. I, in a very harmonizing a way. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, let's go ahead to Auntie. I like the, because um, we know Jasmine, for this album, if you guys know, or if you hadn't um, listened to it yet, she does a song and then she does like a, um, an interlude to the yeah. next song. So Bodies was like the, the intro. Of another woman. Right, it's the view of the other, like of the woman who's kind of telling the tale, right? Right, right, right. Well, that's how I'm interpreting it. Yeah. But okay, so the next one is Antoinette's Tale. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay so what do you feel about that what do you feel about Antoinette's tale what do you what do you feel about her saying niggas can't handle if a woman takes the same liberties as them they can't I'm gonna say that but I'm gonna let you say what you want to say they they can they can be they can they can have their whole phase they can they can do whatever it is they can entertain they can be outside of of friendships and relationships and uh, uh and when it comes to a woman it, the same regard is not taken like it, it's not treated the same mm-hmm. way even in the dating phase right mm-hmm. like if if i heard she didn't got around if i heard she didn't been with my friend or if i heard she been with the dude you don't want her you don't want her but she, she is hey, damaged goods right? she is damaged come on she is damaged goods but have to be Damaged goods. When we can we just, can share some we can share some 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 dick. But you could right. girl. I fucked him, girl. He, mm, he got a big dick. But when it comes to dudes, they can't do it. They can't do it. They can't do it. I would so even that's, go that's, as far as I've heard a girl. I've been in a I've been in a a, a, a conversation 
mm-hmm. where a female was talking about a guy that she was talking to, right? She wanted to have sex with him. But there was another girl in the conversation that had already been with him, <laughs> right? She brought it up. She was like, dang, girl, you know, little, 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 I did, you know what I'm saying? I hit like about five or six years ago. Like, you know, we had a little Ray fun. Ray J, I hit it first. <laughs> let me tell you, right, smash the homie. Listen, let me tell you what the other girl said. How was it? I'm just Wait, saying. Because we want to know before we go in there, right? Before we, before I have him as a body count. <laughs> it's the car facts. It's the, I mean, it's the, it's let the me nigga facts. the car facts, yes. <laughs> like, why does why is it not like that with me? I don't understand why you know it's so- I, for me. And I'm this is only my assumption. I'm not a man, so I don't know. Right. But I can only think that when they take on a woman, mm-hmm. it's like they get a little possessive. They don't want what they any. Do. They don't want men, to other men, who have had what they have. Understandable. Because mm-hmm. you got to think about what she's doing to you. You looking at this nigga. And it's like, damn, did she? Did she do that to him? Mm-hmm. Did to me? But, but do we think the, about it? No, but we think about the same thing. We do, but we thinking about it in a more like sexual way. For me, I think so. I think we think about it in okay. a more sexual way. Like, okay, well, he did that. Okay, he, he, really? Does he really eat it like that? Okay. Like, <laughs> is he like really the the right. pee monster? <laughs> right. What that do though? I mean, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Yeah. So, yeah. That, love the interlude. <laughs> love the in, love. Love the intro. Yes. That, the song? intro was body. This um interlude was Antoinette's tell. I I, mm-hmm. I mean, it, there is a double standard, and what you gonna do about it? You know, I guess we're gonna just continue to talk about it until the end of time, huh? Yeah, because it's not going to change. It's there's not. there's not going to be any resolution to it. It's just always going to be men have their ego as far as when it comes to sexual women and their sexuality. Right. We get um, conceptualized as as being hoes and um, as being freaks, as being you know too sexual. Okay, let me ask you a question. Okay. okay. Do you think your husband wants you to be? Like a sexual being just out here, just being like, oh yeah. When he sees his wife, he's like, people, they look at her and they're like, yeah, she's, she's that. In a sense, yes and no. Okay, explain. Because I think every man wants their woman to, to look good and Mm -hmm. to be, um, for a man, maybe in his head, to be like, man, she's beautiful or she, she fine or, you know, she look good. Man, he's lucky that he got something like that. Man, how he gets something like that. Mm-hmm. But he, I, I'm sure he doesn't want it to the point where like people are looking at me and fantasizing about me. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? I think that's a difference, right? Yeah. Yeah. What do you think? I how, how do you think Chris would be? <laughs> <laughs> he has no no thoughts, no feelings, or emotions. <laughs> he is, he's Lord. You just gotta know him. Bless his heart. I love him, but you just got, I don't think he would care either way. He wouldn't. Want, well, no, I'm lying. I'm lying because yeah. I remember one time I went and worked out. We went worked out, and I used like I would go running. This was like during the summertime, so it was warm. So I had like little, little, little bitty Nike shorts, and I would run in the neighborhood with them. Fine, perfectly fine. We went yeah. to the gym one time, and he looked at me like, "The fuck you got that on for?" And then he told me afterward, and he always does this, and I appreciate him for doing this all the time. But he told me afterward, he was just like, "Don't wear them. Don't don't wear them little shorts to the gym no, no more." Don't do that. Don't do that. So. <laughs> Yes, I, so he does not want I mean, to, to be for, the, for a little bit of you know not jealousy but a little bit of like I want to keep you to myself I think it's sexy when it gets a mm-hmm. little overwhelming like don't wear that top you showing too much like dude like I, 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 had, them te- I had these titties when you made me whatever okay <laughs> like you know a little overbearing is too much but you know a little bit of you know 
what where you going with that on? Like, yeah, you know, I'm about yeah. to do a thing out here. You know, I'm about to, you know, step you know, that's their love language. That's how they tell us they love us. Where you mm-hmm, going with that on? That's it. No, that's that's how they tell us you look good. Uh-huh. Where you going with that on? <laughs> <laughs> okay, What's so the um the next song is Pick Up Your Feelings. Ooh, one of my favorites. Yes. Hey, 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 average. <laughs> she said, "Bad bitch, I am not average." What's up? Come on, she said I've been Jack acting different. Me. Let me slick my edges down before you come <laughs> with stuff like this. Like, let me let me clutch my pearls. Let me make sure my shirt is tucked in. Like, come on. She said, "You so sloppy. How I caught you slipping how you, up? How I catch you slipping. I'm you the main bitch. Average. Run me my keys. What's up? What's up?" <sighs> She said, get your shit and get out. What do you, what do you think she was talking about? To the about left, to the left. <laughs> That's the modern That's day. That's what she was saying. That's to the, the left, day. to the left. Boom. That's what I think. Yeah. I think she was saying, I'm tired of your crap. I'm not going to continue to deal with this. You're not going to continue to reap the benefits of being with me and doing your thing. And you Bye, sloppy. Felicia. Bye, nigga. Big stupid. Bye. Stupid. What you did? How you be yeah. so sloppy? <sighs> ay, ay, ay. You, you, know? you wanted me to catch you. <laughs> okay, you so I'm not even... me to be crazy. Do you mm-hmm. know of a friend? Uh-huh. You don't have to say any specific friend, specific uh-huh. friend's name, but mm-hmm. do you know of anyone who um who caught their spouse like or their partner or their girlfriend boyfriend slipping up? Yes, man. Let me tell you. <laughs> back way back when, I have a friend that um, called her boyfriend. He wasn't doing anything just yet, but she called him slipping. He was sloppy, so she cuckoo, and I love her for it. <laughs> hey, something I would never do, but hey, I love her for it. I would be right there with her if you know, she sometimes ever emotions get the best of you. They do. Mm-hmm. My sis was my sis was in the bushes outside the window, <laughs> watching him watch TV with another female while his hands Wait, were wrapped around. So she was watching TV with them, and they didn't even know it. And they didn't even know it. <laughs> this nigga, how you so sloppy that you bring this bee to your house? Like I'm not gonna find out. I have no speechless. words. Right. <laughs> I'm just, I'm so speechless. I don't. Yes. Speechless. That's it. Do you, you have any friends or were you ever cuckoo? Mm, mm, I'm crazy now. So <laughs> <laughs> what's but, the instance that you were crazy? Well, like, in, in reference to this particular song, mm-hmm. I did when she said you so sloppy how I caught you slipping up Mm -hmm. I did catch this one guy that I was dating Mm -hmm. dating he had a whole fiance and I didn't even know didn't even know it so he's just he's just dating you with a whole fiance yes how he do that like how 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 did she because you you you're clearly you're ki- clearly being kept a secret. First of all, he invite well he invited me to his house one day, and I'm already particular about like being around people and like in their right. environment. So I was like, okay, I'll go. Went in the house. I, I was like, mm, I just you know when your spirit just like eh, you gotta leave. Right. But there was like no trace of a woman at all. No trace of a woman. That's no, weird. no pictures or nothing. So, I'm, I'm, so in my mind now, I'm thinking like, so 
did you <laughs> take down the pictures or like did you like, do did that? You, did you do that just purposely? because I was coming? Or is it like no pictures of her in general? Like she's okay with nothing being up that shows that he's in a relationship with you. I don't know because if you if you're in home, you're gonna see family pictures. Yeah. If we're living together. I mean, even on the, fr- the refrigerator, like you're gonna see something. A little magnet, something. I don't know, child, mm. but yeah, he caught I call him slipping up. Oh, mm. yeah. <laughs> yeah. glad he in the past. What 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 said on the? He had a little, you know, because I told you I like to ask the C beforehand. So right, was, right. You know, it was like, yeah. well, glad you asked. Work. The C. <laughs> okay. Nope. So we're going to go into the next interlude. So the next interlude is Ari's tale. <laughs> it's self-explanatory. Let's get into it. <laughs> I love me some Ari. I, I, love, me. I love me Ari Lennox. Now we so had a conversation funny. about yes. I, I just love how expressive and fluent and just outspoken she is about her sexuality. Mm-hmm. She's I, I mean she's a beautiful that. girl. I she love is. her, and she just flaunts. She's okay with flaunting it. She's un- unapologetically okay with flaunting her beauty and she should be how old is she she's young right I she has so. to, she's like 25 maybe right mm. she, she's I don't probably know. in her 20s i would yeah she's definitely in her 20s i don't so you're gonna, let, you gonna let um sean talk to you crazy for the dick uh, no ma'am <laughs> <laughs> bitch get in here <laughs> no nope. ain't gonna hate yes me. daddy ain't gonna hate <laughs> me. What, what, what movie that was on ATL. ain't gonna happen no <laughs> i don't care how good your dick is you're not gonna make me lose my career mm-hmm. you're not gonna call me no type of bitches and hoes <laughs> nope it ain't that good my, was, my 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 i was my, literally my, willing to ruin my career mm. i'm gonna take a day off for you yeah no. i'll call it sick anytime <laughs> i'll call it, it don't take much it don't take much <laughs> Hey, I'm mm. just I'm not coming in today. I'm but sorry. Ari is 29. I looked that up. Okay, she's 29. Oh, she, okay. she's like she's so young. <laughs> she 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 getting up there, but she, I, I still like the way that she's, you know, just out with her sexuality. She yeah. don't mind showing her body and loving on it. And she don't mind saying <laughs> she doesn't mind saying that dick spoke life into life. Yes. Yeah. The way she said it was so poetic. And she said turmoil. Turmoil. Mm. That that, that dick done put you that stretched you out. It that dick then put her in the valley (laughs) of the shadow of death. Mm. (laughs) And let it feel no evil. (laughs) Let it let it feel no evil. But that are with me. Come on, girl. That's funny. What's the next song? That's funny. <laughs> okay, stop. I gotta stop playing with you. Okay, so this next song is, I guess it's it's an explanation to Iris' tale about yeah, that did. Breaking back by tomorrow. You look, take my car. Do whatever you need to ride to work, baby. Take my car. Put it down. Look, I'll I'll call off tomorrow. You can take my car. I'm gonna just stay home. It's she said it's a shame what he do to me. 
That's a shame. Mm. I get out of my mind when he come around. Like, what? what? My girlfriends be like, can you just imagine being like in a room with your girlfriend, like having conversations, like we having conversations and I'm just telling you about this day and your girlfriend's like, girl, like, what are you doing? He is a bomb, bitch. He is lazy. What? He is taking advantage of you. And she's like, Ari, yes, yes, he is. <laughs> That dick spoke life into me. Life. It touched my soul. <laughs> it invigorated me. <laughs> Bitch, I needed to be rejuvenated, okay? Right. Don't you are a sugar mama. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's and no, I cooked the breakfast. It's Judge the mom. eggplant. It's the <laughs> eggplant emoji, sis. That's what it is. It touched my soul. <laughs> That's some ne- that's some next level dick. Like that's the highest level of the Mario game on the Nintendo that's dick. That's when you get that that's mushroom. Some you do, 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 do. Right. That's some <laughs> intense dick. No, that's when you got the that's when you got the star. You dun, 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 you running straight through, hitting everything, Boop. hitting everything. Like not jumping on, not doing it right, just just running into shit. Just whatever. I don't even care. Just let me get to the flag. I want to get to the get- flag. To the little stars. Let me let me get there. Girl. Woo. Put it down. Mm. Yes, Jasmine. I'm so, so silly. I'm, I'm here for it. Okay, so I since want to see it on it. He already put it down. He wanna do it. spit on it yeah can i log out i mean can i go now because i just want to you know damn my husband not here yet damn okay so mm. this, we can continue mm. talking because that that yes. kind of gets me in a it gets you in the mood on it like yeah. do i don't know if i want to sit on it or spit on it which one am i doing <laughs> which one Both? what's in what what in what what order like i don't know i don't does know it matter oh. it doesn't you know, matter it actually yeah. does matter i want to spit I can't sit and spin on it at the same I mean, time. So I can, well, maybe I can, you already gonna be lu- you should already be lubricated. I probably am. You know, this is just extra. I know this is probably a lot <laughs> for y'all, but I don't even care. I know that song is a lot. Lo- that song is a lot. It's that crunchy. song is a lot. It is. Ari, hmm. yeah, yeah, girl. Right. Mm. Yeah, she yeah. said I need more than a text message. I she do. She you said don't have to pull she pulled off something impressive. I, I need I need more than these good morning messages. I need more than Valentine's flowers. I need mm-hmm. you. I need you to really pull out the stops. You need to pay right attention. Now. Yes. Yes. You need to yes. pay attention. If you want to get all this good loving, mm. I need you to like go to infinity and beyond for this because it's good now. I'm not okay. So I don't even care if he gets mad about this. He shouldn't get mad about this, but. I think my husband like kind of knew he was like really in tune with me mm-hmm. not you know not too long ago yeah and I was like what are you doing to me I really yeah this song resonated with me I was like yeah. bruh like I, I think like he it. really he literally went in my head and understood what what you wanted what I wanted yeah I had to say nothing. Yeah. And he understood what I wanted. Yeah. That's been 20 years for me. Yeah. yeah. Well, that shit, no, I can't even lie. I love my husband, but he, <laughs> he don't I mean, get it all so, the time. Know, I, I can say this, like, they're, they're, my husband has never really been off, but yeah. you know what I'm saying? We have so many things that we, that we go through as women. Um, you know, we can be emotional about something. We mm-hmm. can be off we can have some other things on our mind 
and it can just not be the same type of feeling or we can not be in it as much as you know usual Mm -hmm. but I can't say that he's had an off day well sexually he's not off but I'm saying I think it's more so of us that if we're not because you know how women we have to be in it like mentally everything has to be right mentally emotionally yes because we already talked about this Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. we talked about this. If you are not, if I'm mad at you, I don't want you. I don't want you right now. Not right Give me now. About ten minutes, because I'm a Gemini, so I'm gonna be over it in ten minutes. See, not me. I'm a Sagittarius, so I like to hold on to a grudge until mm, you really apologize. On <laughs> ain't gonna hold on to it. I'm gonna be ready to to do the do in about fifteen minutes. Let me get. You want it. that? Mm-hmm. But at the same time, I'm still gonna be upset with you. Mm-mm. Yeah, I'm gonna be upset. Yeah, I'm gonna be over it. I'm like, dang, why are you still thinking about it? That's me. That's a problem. That's, I mean, that's because I'm me. with the Cancer. <laughs> I'm with the <a> Scorpio. <laughs> Ooh. A big old freaky ass Scorpio. <laughs> <laughs> What's next? <laughs> next one is Donna's Tale. Yeah. What's up? Every um, woman Donna? tricks off is what she's saying. She Donna say said that. every woman tricks off. I'm weak. I never, I never thought about it like that. I'm not gonna lie. I'm never, I never thought about. But that's very true. I cannot sit here and lie and say that I've never said, "Dang, I want him to do this for me." Let me go on here and bust it wide open real quick. It's a bartering system. You got something it, I want. I got something I you something want. You want. <laughs> what you want to yes. do <laughs> how we gonna how we gonna make this thing happen do you want it quick do you want it long like kitchen bathroom bed what you want that's it like we 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 never thought about it that you know we try to make it seem like oh you tricking off you going you you being a, a the gold digger you get mm-mm, we all do it well i've always known that i mean when you it's you hold sexual power within yourself. You do. So yes, you can women. use it to to levitate anything that you kind of want from the whoever. Same yeah, I was about to say that's why I say whoever. Whoever. So, yeah. You was on yeah. Donna. I hear you, Donna. I'm with you. <laughs> I feel you. I do it. I do it. Okay, so the next one is going to be um, price tags. Money that pussy wet. Facts. That's all I'm gonna say. Facts. <laughs> Money does indeed contribute to the lubrication of the vagina. <laughs> hey, <laughs> I I'm think you're right. onto something. I think you're uh-huh. onto something. Uh-huh. <laughs> Why you think yes. that? So, like, I, I just really feel like. When a woman feels like she can be taken care of, and not just financially, though, yeah, this is talking about financially, but mentally, yeah. spiritually, emotionally, physically, financially, you want to 
make sure I mean, wet girl does not want to be spoiled. Wet girl does not want that man to be like, baby, here go my car, go to sex, go to Nordstrom. Do you get, you know, what, what, what woman don't want her man to be like, here go a couple stacks, baby, spend it how you want it to be spent. Like personally, but I want- But everybody not getting that. No, but I'm saying we're talking about price tags. She's yeah. saying, she's yeah. saying, I want, I want, I want, you know, this is what I want. I want a man that's going to spend that money. Now, personally, (laughs) I want a man that's going to buy me some land, like in my name. So I know it's real. I want a man that's going to put some investments in my name. You took the words right out of my mouth. I was like, you can keep the material stuff. Right. I want the house. I want like acres. Upon mm-hmm. acres. I want something that really want. means something. Yes. I want something I can pass down. 20 years from now. Yeah. But I mean, I get it. I like the nice stuff too. Price yeah. tag. Put it on me. I can't lie and say that being spoiled is not a major turn on. Oh, I'm just is, saying like, it is. it's a major turn on. Yeah. If I feel like I can get it myself or do it myself, then what I need you for? I like for you to spoil me. Spoil me, daddy. <laughs> I'm just well, I like being spoiled as well. Yeah. It's yeah. a it's a good feeling. It's a refreshing feeling. It's like, yes. okay, yes, you recognize my worth. Yeah. Yes. Or not even my worth. You just recognize me. You just want to say, hey. It's... You recognize that I deserve, you know, nice things or I deserve to feel special and mm-hmm. put on a pedestal. I like it. Yeah. Yes. Okay, so the next one is going to be um, another interlude, Rashida's yep. Tale. When she said that and and it's, and it's like you, she cracked up. Yeah. She yeah, was like she cried. she went back. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, it just lets you it just lets you know people make mistakes. People make mistakes. And um a lot of time it has nothing to do with the other person. Sometimes it has everything to do with the other person. But that doesn't mean that they they care less or they don't care about that person at all. So eh, it's just a sad situation. You know what? I'm kind of looking forward to um, hopefully Issa Rae really doing like um, like a visual for yeah. this album oh. because I would really like to know a part of like Rashida said, uh, uh, all of the interludes. Like mm-hmm. like what, what, what made you sleep with that best friend? Mm-hmm. You love this woman so like so much. Like, what made you really want to sleep with? Her like she said, she, I mean, it wasn't it wasn't anything. It was probably just the moment, you know. But I know it's like circumstances. You know, you love someone. I just, I, I don't mm-hmm. know. I just, yeah. I just feel like if you know you love someone, and you're, I don't. But you, like you said, you, just, you don't know. Yep, she you happened. just don't know, but. I, I want to see this visual. Oh yeah. I hope they come up with it. Oh yeah. That I, I would love though. I'm not gonna lie. That one was like, oh I know. It was hurt sad. my feelings. It was sad. It was sad. So that one is the inner It leads to um, Lost One. Lost One, which is a, a good song. This song, Lost like Lost one. it made me emotional. I'm not gonna lie. It is an emotional song. It's an emotional, emotional song. I'm gonna go ahead and play it.
<laughs> that one. I got choked up right there. She said, oh, if it's know. too late, I understand. Sometimes yes. it's too late to make amends. Sometimes it's too late, but it, mm. uh, when you go further, she said, I don't want you to love. I don't want you to love nobody. Like, don't have too much fun without me. And she said she knows it's selfish. And that's yeah, some I, type of shit I would say. And that's the type of shit yeah. I would feel. Like, honestly, I'm- after I heard this, I needed a whole cigarette, a Virginia Slim. Just look. Like, like I felt like waiting to exhale. I didn't, I'm, I'm looking at you. And you just sitting there, look, shaking. Like- shaking. They cut my hair off. One side of the cut. <laughs> I'm almost like I'm dying inside. Like, oh my goodness. That's when you know you like really fucked up and you really, you really messed up. You really yeah. messed up. It's, you know, when you're in a relationship and for whatever reason the relationship does not work, but you're in love and mm-hmm. that person, <laughs> you still love that person. Like, I think every woman can relate to this. It's hard. It's hard to deal with. Um, it's hard to heal from situationships sometimes. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> and people heal in different ways. Some turn to the bottle. Yeah. Some turn to drugs, maybe, you know, a little weed or she whatever. You drink and you drink and get faded. You and feel like faded. that's your only option. Yeah. Like right. I'm I'm hurting over here. Like, how else am I supposed I'm to struggling? Eat this thing? Yeah. Yeah. Lost one, that's a good song. It definitely uh, I'm I'm not gonna lie, I've felt that emotion before. I felt that yeah. emotion before in relationships and well not relationships, but mm-hmm. in a certain in a certain relationship. I really I remember mm-hmm. dating this one guy and I, I really liked him and I was just like, mm-hmm. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta take that L. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, whatever. Yeah. Precious I, tale. I, what love this song what's precious tale about mm, she ain't dealing with no broke nigga that's what it's about <laughs> let's see let's see Period. Period, Pooh. I'm not gonna deal. I'm not gonna deal one. with with you if you can't contribute to my success at all. What are you here for? I mean, that makes complete and total sense. Yes. If you're not gonna be supportive, Mm-mm. if you're not going to be, if you can't bring kind of- anything to the table. What I, I mean, that should be a given anyway. Like, if someone is not gonna do that for you. But you got a lot of sis, a lot of of our sisters out here dealing with men that bring nothing to the table, that are lazy. But why? What but, makes you entertain? I don't even care. It's the dick. I don't even care about that. I'm gonna be talked about. No, her. I don't even. Sometimes I don't even think it's the dick. I think it's just the companionship. Just having that companion, any companionship. Mm-hmm. Sometimes a woman can a woman can take what she can get at the point at that time and that sucks but you know you have to know your worth yeah and know that i know they have the phrase or the saying i can do bad all by myself like you don't Mm -hmm. want to do bad by yourself you want to do great by i show that show damn well ain't gonna do bad with you right if i'm gonna do bad okay i can be by myself but adding on another person and their issues and what they're trying to project on you. Right. No. no. Yep. Yep. I hear you precious. <laughs> <laughs> we feel you, girl. We feel, feel you. Girl. So the next one we're going to go into is the other the side. side. We want to let you know why, yeah. why she feel that way. Why she feel that way. <laughs> yeah.
Her rent is due. She only got half. She only got half. She can't ask nobody. She ran out of favors. She said, I never save up. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say? Like, how do you conceptualize that song? Like, how do you feel like? What do you can think we she's say in that song? Can you can we first um acknowledge the fact that I can relate to I work at a job I care nothing about but you know I can't say that because the, the job we work you have to care we bless yeah. you have to bless you have yeah, to care you have to you care still blessed to have it you still yeah, yeah 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 but I'm what I'm saying when I say that is that it's not my passion it's not something that I wake up saying I, oh I, my god I'm so ready to go and crush this job today no no, no. No, but I can say that I cannot wait to be rich and I, you know, I want a better life and I think of having a better life. I see myself on the other side, like right. Jasmine, were you, were you with me when I was doing my vision board? Like, did you see me doing my vision okay, board? So we have a conversation. Were we talking on the phone when you was making this song? I'm just trying to figure this out. This song, I love this song and I, I really feel like it kind of embodies what a lot of women kind of see themselves doing. Like yeah. they want to find them someone who has a lot of money. They want to find someone who's going to be okay. Get that big old booty you want. They're going to find someone mm -hmm. that's going to give them this lifestyle. But then I feel Look, like it, at what that? cost though? Mm -hmm. At what cost? Because in the like towards the end of the song, she was just like, um soccer mom getting wasted Hermes mm -hmm. bracelet and um face talking about facelifts and stuff like that like but at what cost like are you going to trade how you should feel about yourself most most money? most women don't even get that far they don't even get that far they they can't think they can't think past the concept of I'll never be broke again she said, God is my witness. I'll never be like, that's the, that's the concept in their, in their mind. And, and we don't, we want to feel like that. We think like that. Like once I get there, I'm never going to be broke again. I'm never going to be at that point where I can't pay my rent. I can't. But you can do that by yourself. Like, and you, I get, you don't, but it, it feels even better when you have that NBA player. <laughs> Since I hear you. Sis, I'm trying to be on the other side too. Me and my man, me and my husband. I don't need no NBA player. But me and my husband, we're trying to be on the other side. You feel me? I want to be rich. I mean, we're trying to be on the other side too, but I definitely don't want us to sacrifice my any my morals world. or any standards mm -hmm. yeah, or, I understand. or how I feel about myself. Mm-hmm to be on the other side. I don't want to have to alter myself because someone looks at me and, and thinks that I don't meet their standard of beauty. Right, right, right. Oh, and this another, and the song that's going to be coming up next really speaks to that to me. <gasps> oh, that made me so sad. Oh, let's it, talk uh, about that. You know, let's move on. I like yeah, that. Let's, let's, let's talk. On. Let's do that one. A man, you, it's a Mm. that when I heard that that really crushed my poor little heart yeah because a lot I mean a lot of people feel that way we we are um it, it, fixated on the superficial club. world we're fixated yeah. on the superficial world you take it back to players club when she said girl go make that money don't go let it make you mm -hmm. like it we are put in the forefront to use use your body for what it is that you want period but when she use said what it you sounds got. to get what you want to get to i mean great let's, let's really think about it we do it at our jobs hell we do we'll do it in the supermarket if it means that we'll get somebody to take our our uh bags to our car like we 
women are we we use our it doesn't we don't think about it as we're using our sex as a superpower but that's exactly what it is right it is but what it is. When, when her when she said it it's it's like she used it in a negative connotation as if she's trying to get mm-hmm. love and affection yes. from people by using her sex and not just mm-hmm. okay let me get somebody to do this because i know i can just you know mm-hmm. bat right. an eye or smile at somebody and they'll do something for me use your sexuality because you know what that that does to anybody it could be male or female like you know if you use your charm and you use you use your sexuality you can get something out of that but from what I took from her it's like she used that as a form to get some kind of love or gratification from someone and it still didn't fulfill her and she said she used it as a superpower yes sex is definitely a superpower but if you don't use it how it's supposed to be intended to be used correct and if you're using it to to um kind of supplement something else Mm -hmm. then it's never going to be fulfilled it's never going to be fulfilled okay so the next one is um girl like me yes Yep. Mm. what you make of that I don't know this song speaks to me it, you know and how men kind of idolize the IG models and the women that <laughs> are half naked and over sexualized mm-hmm. like mm-hmm. I know a lot of women like how am I supposed to measure up to these women like how do I get noticed how do I say hey me and I'm not here. judge yourself at the same time yeah and not yeah. look at myself and not judge every little part of me like look at this role like she don't have this role Drea don't got no roles and they love Drea so <laughs> you know I, you know what I mean how am I supposed to measure up and get a man that I'm looking to get or the type of man that I feel like I deserve when he looking at Drea and I don't look like her and then he leaving and Girl, and then now you on on Tinder trying to uh, what trying is to swipe, swipe left. <laughs> I was about to say, what side is like the good side? <laughs> left or right? I don't know. Swipe. I don't know. Is it swipe right? I don't think it's swipe right. I think it you swipe, is it swipe left. I think I maybe think swipe left is. <laughs> I don't know, girl. I've never been on Tinder. I know nothing about Tinder. But Me either. No, it's it's. The, I've heard it's the hookup site. <laughs> the hookup app. But what about um? You must have wanted something different. Yeah, uh-huh. I think it's speaking to the insecure women in a lot of us. Like, um, they just want a certain man to be impressed with us. Mm-hmm. And how how can how can we impress this guy if we don't look a certain way? It just really makes they just don't understand how insecure that makes us right and And it ain't right judge yourself at the same time right what she said yes it ain't right that these girls winning like (laughs) it it ain't fair it ain't right how these hoes be winning how come they be winning yeah that ain't right that ain't fair ain't no hope for no girl like me right Uh, i mean there is huh i say there is though oh absolutely yeah absolutely that's i think that's one of my um my favorites on that one yeah i mean it was the perfect perfect song for her Mm -hmm. and jasmine to get on um at first i could not tell who was who 
Because like yeah. their runs and everything, like their voice. Oh no, their no. And e- Jasmine runs are different. Well, she she does run a little different, but on this particular one, yeah, yeah, it was it hard was, to tell. It who was, was hard who. to tell who was who. Yeah, but yeah, I agree. I agree. I, I but Jasmine it. runs are <laughs> bit definitely defined and different in everything. Can They're you do everything. it? Can you do it? Which one? Any of them. Like try one of when them. When I try when I try them, yeah, I get them like it it I, I literally will sit there and try one and um and I, I do it till I get it. I wanna do it. I wanna hear it. No, not on no. <laughs> why not i'm not a i'm not an out out singer no i just like to like to hum hmm every now and again hmm. i mean teddy uh, i was about to say teddy Riley could be listening why teddy Riley listening <laughs> why all people uh-uh. have to say teddy Riley? that ain't my ministry that ain't my ministry sis. why can, not does y'all know how to um sing He just sorry, Chandra. I'm so sorry. Huh? <laughs> so where did you get it from? <laughs> um, Daddy Heart. I mean, no, Daddy definitely no. not. Definitely <laughs> not, Mama. Definitely. Like he can't even. Like he can't even rock on a on beat. That's no my rhythm. Dad. That's my daddy. I love. Is him. that the white side of him? That is the yes, man. <laughs> Does he clap off beat too? Oh, <laughs> like yes. when y'all in church? Let me tell you who else clap off beat. Parker. <laughs> she ain't got it. She got this one. I got. <laughs> yep. Yep. That that littlest one I got, that thing, she got rhythm already. Does she? Yes, already. Even when she's singing, she's on she's on beat and she's on tune, even at two. Well, her long little skinny body. I know. <laughs> Man, hotels. That was a good. I, I listened to it every single day, even before we decided we were going to talk about it. Yeah. When I love an album and I can listen to it from start to finish. Yeah. The last album I did that was like Janae Eichel's album. Yeah. Yeah. And I- I don't like because when music new music comes out, I don't listen, but I can't listen to like a new album every single day. I just can't do it. Yeah. So I can I, listen to Jasmine's like I listen to Beyonce's. Yes. That's yeah. Yes. I have look, she, I got a whole playlist full of Jasmine Sullivan songs. Yeah. If I want to feel like I don't know why. Like sometimes I like to tap into my emotion. I like to feel like mm-hmm. an emotion. I'm like, let me listen she to does. a little Jasmine Sullivan. She makes Sullivan. you really tap into your emotions. Like, you know how we were talking about Keisha Cole, how Keisha Cole <laughs> to have you driving off a cliff. You know, she <laughs> Jasmine to have you like she about to die. <laughs> yeah, she you, Keisha will make you you rethink life. You know, you don't know if you want to be here anymore. <laughs> Jasmine Sullivan, Jasmine Sullivan just have you literally wanting to be on your yoga mat with on yes. one side you got your joint, on another side you got your journal. <laughs> yes. And you just like you manifesting. Yeah, you, you just like, you just centering yourself and making sure you still, you know, center. Sage ain't got the sage on the side too. Yes. So I could, when I finish, I could just sage all, mm-hmm. all around me. I'm gonna pray on it. I'm gonna get you out. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I love Jasmine. I do too, but that was good. I, I, love I loved it. it. I enjoyed it. I'm still going to listen to it. And this is definitely going on my favorites, period. Period. All of hers. All of hers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, love I you. enjoyed you. Yes, I enjoyed you too, girl. Yeah, I, another episode <laughs> of Two Dope Girls in the and book. And I want to let you guys know that I am like a zombie right now. Oh yeah, yeah. Y'all just don't know. It's like almost twelve o'clock. We've been. I think we've been, I've been up for twenty four hours. Yeah, at this yeah. Point. You have. Yeah, you need to. But get- um, yeah, I can't wait to see you in person next week. Yes, tomorrow, girl. Week? Oh, well, tomorrow, but then yeah, we'll, but we'll but in for person next, week. next yes. week. Yes, 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 yes. yes, yes. I so can't wait. If you guys want to follow us, um, yes. hit us up at um on IG, Twitter, Facebook. I don't even know why we on Facebook for real because. 
I know, but we are. Yeah. We are. Yeah. <laughs> and yeah. YouTube. We're at Two Dope Girls Pod on all of those platforms. I mm-hmm. am at Grace Face with two underscores. Yep. And I'm at uh, Naturally Pretty. And if you guys have any questions or comments or any suggestions, just hit us up at Ask Two Dope Girls Pod at what fuck shit. How I always do this. Ask two ask two dope girls. Oh shit, what is it? <laughs> look at the goddamn look at the goddamn email. <laughs> ask two dope girls at gmail.com. That is A S K the number two dope girls <laughs> at gmail.com. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we appreciate y'all for listening make sure you like subscribe comment share yes and interact with us because we want to talk oh, yeah. to you guys that's it that's it and All thank right. you for checking us out Until two dope girls week, guys two dope girls out dope girls dope girls dope dope girls dope the dope girls dope 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 girls dope 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 girls